This is Suzanne Wagner, and I'm doing my personal quote and blog for the 14th of August, 2022. My quote for today, upsets in life cause us to sigh. That is because our soul knows a lie. We are asked to take in what monsters breathe out and believe it all without a doubt. But while we can live and be a part of this life, we must also confront toxic conflict and strife. To live in this world is to question another's truth. Understanding perspective requires us to be a sleuth. All possibilities are not open to all of us. That is why we have to be careful as to who we trust. Even when we aim for the stars but end up on a cloud, take in everything that is banned or not allowed. Those that make the rules do not want us to think. To the faithful, knowledge and wisdom are believed to stink. In this life, around you are ghosts, are unresolved dreams seeking to find a host. Become a legend because dreams have power over fate. Never let another's belief close any potential gates. And my blog for today. Doubt is derived from a world lost in its own fear. Doubt is a form of terrorism that likes to adhere to anything that makes one question and stop. When we are uncertain, we will reach, not reach for the top. And then we are terrorized because we might offend. Reality will give hope while perspective wants to defend. What kind of thoughts will you put into this world? Others can disagree, but that flag is still unfurled. The forbidden is underestimated all the time. Humanity loves the shadow for the darkness we pine. The level of injury that this current circumstance has created is larger than the minimization that some constantly understated. If one took a picture of the moral decisions one makes, we would see the uncertainty and fear that is aware of the mistakes. Moral righteousness will eat the souls of some. Some use feigned mor morality because they are truly dumb. They see not what is obvious to all. They intend to undermine what is good so it will fall. I see most politicians as magpies arguing in the trees. They steal whatever sounds seem bright and shiny. But they do not care what is important overall. They intend to make a mess so that others will fall. I see a world with a form of PTSD. We are being subjugated by com compassion fatigue. And while the suffering continues on, many do not see that they are upon. We need more that stand or fall by what they say. We are learning to look behind the constructed fear and dismay. Death of illusion brings honesty into the flow. Death forces truth before we can finally let go. Thanks, everyone.